सब्सक्राइब कीजिए धे आई चैनल को और बेल आइकन को दबाइए लेटेस्ट वीडियो सबसे पहले देखने के लिए Soon it will be possible to carry out autopsies without dissecting the body. India will be the first country in South and Southeast Asia to carry out virtual autopsies. This news was recently told by the Health Minister Harshvardhan on Tuesday. In this DNS we will know about virtual autopsy. Let us first understand about autopsy. An autopsy is an examination of a dead body to determine cause of death the effects or indications of disease or in some cases to identify the dead person forensic pathologists who are physicians trained in the study of diseases and abnormalities perform autopsies with the assistance of autopsy technicians autopsies can also be performed for disease research and medical training a doctor examines the remains inside and out can remove internal organs for testing and collect samples of tissue or bodily fluids such as blood whereas in virtual autopsy doctors use radiation to examine the internal organs to reach a conclusion about the cause of death a ct or an mri machine could be used in the same way that they are used to scan a living human's body a 2013 paper titled virtopsy A new phase in forensic investigation said an autopsy postmortem examination autopsia is a highly specialized surgical procedure that consists of a thorough examination of a corpse to determine the cause and manner of death and to evaluate any disease or injury that may be present autopsy is a word combining virtual and autopsy to find the cause of the death autopsy can be employed as an alternative to standard autopsies for broad and systematic examination of the whole body as it is less time consuming aids better diagnosis and gives respect to religious sentiments the traditional postmortem often makes member of the dead person's family uncomfortable that is the primary reason for increasing use of virtual autopsies internationally as per a paper in the lancet the emergence of virtual autopsy owes to the public objection to dissection of the bodies that reemerged in the uk as a major issue after the organ retention scandals in the late 1990s jewish and muslim communities have religious objections to autopsy and demand for a minimally invasive alternative has increased dr harshvardhan said icmr and aims have studied global practices and taken up this project for dignified management of the dead body the all india institute of medical science aims new delhi and indian council of medical research icmr are working together on a technique for postmortem without dissecting the body this technique is likely to become functional in the next 6 months a virtual autopsy is faster than a traditional one 30 minutes against 2 and a half hours and more cost effective in 2018 in an article in the journal of pathology informatics russian and italian scientists compared the results of virtual autopsy and traditional postmortem Out of 23 cases for which the traditional postmortem examination found a cause of death, 15, that is 65%, were diagnosed correctly using virtual autopsy. For one case for which the cause of death was unascertained, the same result was also obtained during the virtual autopsy. Overall, in 16 out of 25, that is 64% cases, virtual autopsy results match that of the traditional autopsy virtual autopsy began in sweden now it is used in most of the countries like japan the us australia and many european countries as a standard technique